ethanoic acid. In this module, you will learn about ethanoic acid and its properties. You may have observed your mother using vinegar while making pickle or cooking noodles for you. Well, vinegar adds tanginess to the food items and also acts as a preservative. Vinegar has a carbon compound as one of its main constituent which is responsible for its tangy taste. This carbon compound is the carboxylic acid called ethanoic acid. Actually, vinegar is the 5 to 8 percent solution of ethanoic acid in water. So, let us study about this carbon compound, ethanoic acid, in detail. The molecular formula of ethanoic acid is CH3COOH. It consists of a carbon atom that is attached to three hydrogen atoms and one carboxylic acid functional group. Let us now check some important physical properties of ethanoic acid. It has a sour taste and a pungent smell. It is highly soluble in water. All these properties we have already seen while discussing about vinegar. Another important physical property is its melting point which is 290 Kelvin. Due to its low melting point, it freezes during winters and so its other name is glacial acetic acid. Let us now move to the chemical properties of ethanoic acid. For this, let us do some experiments. Shown here is a test tube having 1 milliliter of ethanoic acid. To this, let us add an equal amount of ethanol and a few drops of concentrated sulfuric acid. Now, let's warm this mixture in a water bath. Next, let's add the resultant mixture to the beaker containing 20 to 30 milliliters of water. On doing so, we get a fruity smell. This fruity smell is produced because of the chemical reaction of ethanoic acid. In the presence of concentrated sulfuric acid, the hydrogen of the alcohol and the hydroxyl from the carboxylic acid are lost that together form a water molecule. The remaining part of the two compounds bond together, giving rise to a new carbon compound, ethyl ethanoate. This carbon compound is an ester and has a fruity smell. Because of the fruity smell of the esters, these are often used in the manufacture of perfume. This reaction of alcohol with carboxylic acid forming an ester is known as an esterification reaction. Interestingly, we can convert the ester back to alcohol and acid. This can be done by adding an alkali, sodium hydroxide to the ester, ethyl acetate. Sodium hydroxide reacts with ethyl ethanoate forming sodium acetate that is the sodium salt of ethanoic acid and ethanol. This reverse reaction of esterification reaction is used in the synthesis of soaps. So, this reverse reaction is called the saponification reaction. In a saponification reaction, one of the products is the sodium salt of the carboxylic acid. Such sodium salts can also be formed by the direct reaction between an ethanoic acid and the alkali sodium hydroxide. During this reaction, the sodium salt is formed along with water. This acidic nature can also be confirmed by the litmus paper test. Its solution turns the blue litmus paper red. However, it is not a very strong acid as mineral acids like hydrochloric acid. It is so because not all the molecules of ethanoic acid remain ionized in the solution. In contrast, in the aqueous solution of hydrochloric acid, all the molecules remain ionized. The acidic nature of ethanoic acid is further responsible for some of its chemical reactions. Let's check out one such reaction. Shown here is sodium carbonate in a test tube. To this, let us add a dilute solution of ethanoic acid. A gas is released which is then allowed to pass through the freshly prepared lime water. As we can observe, the lime water turns milky. It happens because ethanoic acid 
reacts with sodium carbonate to form sodium ethanoate water and carbon dioxide. The gas released is carbon dioxide that turns the lime water milky. Let's recap. Vinegar is 5 to 8% solution of ethanoic acid in water. The molecular formula of ethanoic acid is CH3COOH. Ethanoic acid has a sour taste, pungent smell and low melting point of 290 Kelvin. Ethanoic acid is soluble in water. Its solution is weakly acidic. Ethanoic acid forms ethyl ethanoate and ester on reacting with ethanol in the presence of sulfuric acid. The reaction is called esterification. Saponification is the reverse reaction of esterification in which ethyl ethanoate reacts with sodium hydroxide to form sodium ethanoate and ethanol.